Thank you for selecting an Infratec Home Management System. Infratec's Home Management System is an exclusive feature that enables the smart home integration of heaters directly into your home management system for the ultimate convenience. Our home management control is compatible with top selling systems like Lutron, Crestron, Control4, Savant, and others. In our Choosing a Location video, we show you how to select the ideal placement for the home management main relay panel and the user control. Now let's review how to install and troubleshoot our home management system. Like all Infratec heaters and controls, installation should only be done by a licensed electrician. Before installing or servicing any Infratec equipment, you'll need to disconnect all power at the main feed. Now let's begin by referring to the wiring diagram that came with this control system. It reflects the exact configuration you ordered. You can also find a sample wiring diagram on Infratec's technical support site or on the brochures and specs page under the resource tab. All Infratec custom controls are configured in a similar fashion. Bring the main feed for all the heaters that this panel will control to the main distribution block. The amperage of your main feed will be specified on the drawing. Next, connect the heaters to the circuit breakers. They'll be labeled H1, H2, H3, and H4. Be sure to connect the appropriate heaters to the breakers specified. Once the main feed is connected to the main distribution block and the high voltage line is connected to the heaters, you'll be able to connect the control signal. Refer to the manufacturer of the third party 0 to 10 volt DC user control for proper wiring instructions. Once your third party controller is wired properly, connect the 0 to 10 volt DC signals to the control terminal strip in the upper right hand corner of the control panel. For example, 1A, 1B, etc. Your custom control configuration will determine exactly where to land. You can refer to your wiring diagram for guidance. If you're looking to control multiple relays with a single control signal, jumper the XA terminals together and the XB terminals together in whatever zone configuration you desire. Please note the X represents the SCR number associated with the terminals. Double check to ensure that the polarity is correct by verifying that you have positive XA, negative XB. Once all of your low voltage terminals are connected, your installation is complete. The heaters are now ready to operate. In the event that you experience issues with installation, we're here to help. We provide a flow chart to assist you with troubleshooting. You should always refer to this first. Now let's walk you through some simple troubleshooting steps. Before you begin, please note, when you're taking readings, all should be line to line, not line to ground. In addition, all readings should be taken with the heaters installed and the control signal at 100%. Let's begin. First, check to see if there is main feed AC voltage at the distribution block. Next, is the 10 volt DC control signal present between XA and XB in the upper right hand corner of the panel? There will be an amber load light on every active SCR. Please note that the X represents the home management relay number associated with the terminals. Now, check to see if there is main feed AC voltage at the output of the breakers. You will take measurements between H1, H2, etc. You will see this at the bottom of the panel. Verify if the heater is pulling the specified amperage. You'll need to take the readings using an amp clamp at the output of the breaker associated with the heater. You can find this at the bottom of the panel. If you've gone through each of these steps and are still having issues with low heat or no heat, please contact the Infratec technical support team. We're standing by to help. We hope we've given you the information you need for a seamless installation. If you still have questions, please contact us. You can also visit our technical support page for more troubleshooting tips, wiring diagrams, or to access our online customer service portal.